This development is very unique because we have three planes. The, the roofscape, the ground level and the basement makes a perfect area to create an eco-sustainable habitat. Then we need to use nature-based principles. But in doing that, the plants will need to be very low maintenance and very resilient in nature. And what sustainable too, right? Yes. The size of this development, we can actually easily allow 40% of the land to do edible plants, medicinal. And usable. And usable. With this, we actually can create a more diverse fauna by attracting a lot of butterflies, dragonflies. So basically, it's a very holistic way of uh, living. Uh, so nature education actually is very important. And actually, I'm very interested uh, with these regenerative woods. Yeah. You know, it will not be your, your normal ornamentals. It will be a world of wonder there. But the other unique feature of this development is the sustenance program because it's never been done. Once we finish the DLP of this project, we will still be there. We will carry on for the next two years teaching people to grow their own food. Yeah. Right? Uh, learn some basic culinary skills. We will definitely have culinary workshops. Yeah. Right? Uh, we can reintroduce old foods, our traditional foods, uh, yeah. to remind them of, of the past, yeah. the growing up, the childhood. And this actually ties very nicely back to the concept of uh, bungalow-inspired living. Mm. When people were living in bungalows, they grew their own food in the garden. This project will bring over charm in a modern setting.